Close your eyes. Keep them closed. Hi, Keep It Crazy family. So today and tomorrow's Operation Bring Joy. What kind of operation should we call it? We don't know. Um, a special friend. Operation Bring a Special Friend. There we go. My mom had or has two dogs. Um, they were sister, well, brother and sister. And my Aunt Bonnie had surprised her with these two dogs a uh, long time ago, around Thanksgiving 15, of like... Over 15 years ago. 15 years ago. Mm-hmm. What are you doing? So do you want to vlog? Oh, okay. Okay. We're moving locations. <laughs> Am I not allowed? It is surprisingly really hard to like hide in this house. Yes. <laughs> like from people. <laughs> Isn't it? So, nice, so, so 15 years ago or so, my body had surprised my mom and she was going through a divorce at the time. He was taking the dogs. It was really, really hard on her. There was just a lot going on. So it was such a sweet gift. Uh, recently, one of the dogs passed away. Uh, within the last few weeks and the other one is going to be going really soon so we don't want my mom to be alone no so we are going to be surprising her and her birthday's in a few days actually yeah. your guys's birthday party's tomorrow yeah. so we are going to be surprising her with a new puppy so yay, yay. i can't wait yeah. oh my gosh she is gonna i think she is gonna love it oh my gosh and she's the cutest little puppy. You guys will have to see in a little bit. Uh, so one of my friends that used to live next door, like in my same neighborhood when we lived over in Gilbert, I've stayed in contact with her and everything. And I saw that she had posted on Facebook and she was like, hey, my dog had some puppies. And I was like, oh my gosh, perfect. So the next part of the story though is <laughs> that was the original plan so we went out to go see these puppies a few weeks ago uh we you know they wouldn't release them until they're eight weeks old but when we went and saw them i had taken bella hannah and aaron with me we had a dog named phoebe that was like aaron's dog like they, our dogs are always all family dogs but then they have like their person you yes. know each mm, dog i feel like true connects to one of you, you know? And this dog, Phoebe, was Aaron's everything. She followed him, she was always in pictures with it, like she just loved Aaron. And when she passed away a few years ago, Aaron was like, I've not seen him cry that much. Like before that, I hadn't seen him cry that much. And ever since then, I feel like he's really good with the dogs, but he's always somewhat had a guard up a little bit. He's just like afraid of getting hurt again. Uh, but when we were up visiting these puppies to pick one for my mom, he fell in love with one of them. And he was like, Crystal, like, I just feel so connected to this one. And I was like, well, I was like, are you sure? Like, we have enough dogs, like, you know? And he's like, I don't know. It's just like, I just feel something with this one. And I do feel like that you do. You have that connection. When you first needed a puppy or a dog, you feel that connection. Sorry, yeah. Sadie's chewing on something. Sadie, what, what are we doing? Sadie. Sorry, right, we're in balance of Come here. What are we doing? No chewing. What are we doing? It's probably a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> probably someone's shoe. <laughs> probably Bella's shoe. <sighs> so I totally believe in that. So I feel okay. like, yeah, you just have that connection. Mm -hmm. And so we are going to be surprising Aaron with the puppy that he connected with. Uh, so I pick him up tonight at 8 o'clock. Aaron has no idea, which is why we had to leave the room. Sadie, are we just, are we just being a troublemaker? <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> She's like, anything and everything I can get into. <laughs> Um, and then tomorrow, so I'm going to keep both puppies overnight tonight. And then tomorrow, Aunt Bonnie is going to come up and my Uncle Steve. And we're going to go over to my mom's house. Yes. She's doing it at her house? Yes, he is, so, he is so excited. He wanted to be a part of this. Yeah. <laughs> he did. Mm -hmm. So this will be a two-day vlog. It'll be like parts because part of it will be tomorrow. Also their birthday party and all that. But tonight I will surprise Aaron. So stay tuned. Oh my God. Ah. That is so exciting. 
<laughs> Have you already picked out the one? He's got the one, right? That he. Yeah, I know which one he liked, and yet, oh, and okay. so I told my friend like after we had left, I messaged or I. Had, Older, I was like, okay, we're gonna take two actually, and so I already have the one that Aaron was really connected to. Oh, good. Already, yeah, deposit because that's so, so important. Like when I picked up Evie, I'd lost a little dog, and I was looking out my door, and, and here was all these puppies running around across the street from me. So I went and ran across the street and picked up this puppy, and it felt like it had spiritual soul, and I had lost spirit right before these puppies were born. And I felt that connection like right away. That's what Aaron felt. And I haven't seen him feel like that with any puppy. So yes, I (sighs) totally believe in that. And I feel like with everything Aaron's been going through recently and just all of the, I don't know. I just feel like there's something about animals, about dogs that just like bring you comfort and love and just, and I feel like it'll be so good for him. So they're like little angels. They really are. They are. Okay, so it's kind of funny because... Oh. Hey! <laughs> He's coming. So we're going to go over to Petco and get some stuff for the dog. My mom thinks that we're getting stuff to surprise Aaron with the dog. And then Aaron knows about my mom, but they don't know about each other's. <laughs> so it's kind of a... <laughs> so my mom's going to come to Petco with us thinking that she's picking stuff out to surprise Aaron. But really, she's going to be picking out for mom. Coming to Petco with us? Yep. Getting some dog stuff. Woohoo! You're driving. Nice try. Yeah, I won't do that anymore. Thank you, Lucas. I think some of these treats might be bigger than the dog. <laughs> they have to be soft or else. Okay, what kind of training treats are the best? Tiny ones. Look at this little collar with the bow. Yeah, it gets bigger. Okay. Yeah. I think that's perfect. Do you think Aaron would like the blue? Oh. Do you know what I mean for his versus the white? So let's get one. one of these. Let's get one and one, and then he can choose. Okay. And we can return it. Life's a potty. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Look, they have a gotcha t shirt. Oh my gosh. Look, the dogs can get married. <laughs> we have a wedding in time. Just married. <laughs> You can dress up all the dogs like this. Right? It's so cute. Yeah, it's super Maddie. Right? <laughs> and little flower girl dresses. Oh my god, that's, that's cute. funny. Who's getting married? Lucas? No. I'm, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh my gosh, for your dog? Your dog. Yeah. Okay, that's really cute. Why don't you just pick her head in? Is that how we surprise him? Ooh. Yeah, that's amazing. Did they have any other cute ones? I wouldn't, yeah, it looks or maybe one that like Aaron would like. His favorite color is blue. Alana just has a backpack and just sticks it on. Just sticks like her little yeah, dog. Yeah, little dog just hangs out in there. Alana is my little niece and she has a little tiny yeah, dog. He's, he's, he's really so cute. cute. He's cute, huh? Yeah. So this is where the one was, but we can't find any more. There's a boredom buster. Oh, that's cool. Oh, a licking mat. <sighs> so Hallie was telling us about these licking mats the other day. Um, and basically like this, but you put little kibble or whatnot, and then you put it in the freezer, and then all day they can lick it. I'm gonna try it with Sadie. Okay, look at this dog bowl. I'm just saying, look. It matches my bathroom counters exactly. Oh, no way. Yeah, we're getting this. And it matches your pictures in the hallway, though. Yeah. I like it. Oh my gosh, I love it. Ooh, he'll like that one. Okay, let's do that one. Oh, you found a little... Um, Look at this mesh. little bag. Oh, that's cute. A little mesh bag. That's super cute. I like that. Okay, this has where they can pop their little head out. Oh, oh look at the little paws. I think I want to so get a cat cute. instead of a dog. Really? When you're older? Yeah. That would be cool. Oh. This so one has a crystal on the end. <laughs> yes. Oh, that is adorable. Is that was a princess award. Right? It's so cute. <laughs> what if you just get just a few of the essentials and then he comes and picks them when he wants for his stuff? I think that's probably a good idea. What if we take him to the Ryan? Is it Ryan's? Yes. Yes. What if we take him there tomorrow? No, it's not open on weekend. Oh, on Monday. Mm-hmm. And let him choose. 
Because if I had a choice, I would choose this one. That one's cute. But it's not my dog. It's dad's dog. It's dad's dog. Your snake this would look good on. Well then. Do they have like little things for snakes? Yeah, what what fun accessories do they have for snakes? Never looked. I don't know. That would be sick. We were talking about being as quiet as a mouse. And so I got a little mice with them and I gave each one of them and first they looked at them, you know, they're only five years old, you know, and they're looking at it and they're going to do it this and you have to be as quiet as a mouse. So it's gonna sit on your lap and you're gonna be quiet. And then they got to where they really thought they were fun. Did it work? Yeah. They kept them quiet? They put it in their pocket. If you're a teacher <laughs> and you <laughs> teach them five year olds, that's cute. That's cute. They have name tags that are smart tags, so your dog will never get lost. That's not nice. right. How many times dogs run and you're like, ah? <laughs> there you go. You want me to get one for your car keys? That's. I think we do actually. He's only lost his car keys a few times. Do you want to have it engraved with something cool? Do you have a cool name? Yeah, you're, don't you have a new name for your car? Oh, what's the name uh, of your car? It's just Kaylee. It's Kaylee? Yeah. Okay. If, you don't, if not, you can put LP on it. LP, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now you'll never lose your keys again. <laughs> I'm still gonna manage to lose it. What? Don't say that! <laughs> then, he, then he'll lose his phone trying to find where his keys is. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I lose my phone, I don't find my keys. Dope. Perfect. Look how good it turned out. It's actually cool. That's sick. Hi! What is our little secret? We're gonna pick up, not a tiny baby, a puppy. puppy. Aurora's gonna come with me in a little bit or something. We're surprising Dad with it a little bit. Wait, is it here? No, not yet. We gotta go pick it up in a little bit. Yeah, he'll come. He can come with. Oh, he's coming. How did that both stop? Both. We're getting one. One? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Going to Chick Fil A. She went outside. <laughs> she was looking for her friends, not me, guys. <laughs> Mom, I love you. Love you <sighs> okay, we are on our way to go get the puppy. So Aaron thinks that I'm going to pick up the puppy for my mom, but he doesn't know that he's about to be surprised. Okay, we are here. We're ready to go up and get the dogs I'm right excited. Now. I'm so excited. I love puppies. Love them. And they look so cute. They look cute. <sighs> okay, we'll be right back. You're so cute. Look at the little face. So this is going to be Karama's dog. Don't they look like little teddy bears? Look at this, one. this one's going to be mine. No, this is Jazz. I'm going to ask him if I can hug. <laughs> Jazz going to say no. Oh my gosh! They are so cute. They're the cutest puppies ever. Okay, so here's this one. Oh, look at its eyes. It literally looks like a teddy bear. And then here's this one. This is the one we're gonna surprise Aaron with. They're such cute dogs and the owners were amazing. We know the owners, so they were in our previous neighborhood, as I said. Um, but the daughter is the one that would like get up with the puppies and they were in love. They were like, can you send us pictures? Yeah, and like, and they were like, can you send us the names when you pick them out? When you pick them out. And just, you can tell these puppies were so loved. They were already learning the doggy door, already being potty trained. They've had rides in the car. Like they're so well adjusted. So I'm super excited about that, but. Oh my gosh. 
<sighs> Nothing better than a cute puppy. Okay, let's get home and surprise her. So Bella said she was going out with her friends, but she's literally sitting in the driveway I know. waiting. I know. I'm really gonna ask him for it. He's gonna say no, but there's no harm in asking. Get away. What do you think of them? Oh, come here! Come here! Oh, you are so cute! Hi, pretty girl! Oh, hi! Oh, it's hi. wagging its little tail! Oh, oh my oh. goodness! You're so cute! It's <laughs> so cute! Oh. Wait! Don't let dad come out. <gasps> Hold on. Okay, shut the door. That looks fake. It looks fake? No, yeah, but it's a fake dog. It kind of, it kind of does look fake. We're going to surprise grandma tomorrow. No way. I know. She's going to be so happy. Of course. I know. There's two. Do you like it? Are you sure you're not surprising me? Hold on. It's really tiny. You have to be careful. Aaron. Close your eyes. Tight, tight. Keep them close. So Bella's holding Grandma's dog. I know you're probably like, why are my eyes closed? Why are my eyes closed? Okay, because he can open. He can open. So this is Grandma's dog. Oh, how cute. Did you hold it? She's precious. Okay, do you remember when we were visiting the puppies? I know. Remember the one that you really, really felt connected to? I do. Okay, Ariana. You got two? I got the one that you were connected to. Are you serious? We got her. Oh my gosh. Ever in love, forever be. What? <laughs> Can you have what? Can I have it? No! She fell in love with it. This is her too. Dad, I have no friend. This is my friend. I'll be your friend. No. I'll be your friend. I think I had a hole in my heart and this just filled it. Okay, This well, is so awful. Can't, can't mom fill the hole in your heart? <laughs> mom fills a huge part of my heart. But there's a little piece missing ever since Phoebe. So I forgot to say, so they are golden doodles, but they're like, I still have not figured out my light switches. I know we've lived here forever and I still can't figure out my lights. Um, there we go. Okay, so they are golden doodles, so they are the same breed as Maddie, but they're like the mini, or the toy size. I don't know what you call it. So they'll only get like max around like 10 pounds or so. I know, their little Maybe version. Yeah, so about Harley size. Mommy can make me another ant again. Oh, You're an ant! Oh, Yay! <laughs> I like it. I'm attached to that dog now, Mom. Oh, you're going to help take care of her? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, but the big question is, what are we going to name her? Um, the tennis ball is better uh, than Princess Aurora! Princess Aurora! Yeah. Should we name Maybe we should name it like Jasmine or like yeah. Ariel or... Princess. What's its name? Yeah, princess name. Princess name. Yeah, we should name her Ariel. Elizabeth. I feel like no, Jasmine fits. Justin. It. Pressure yeah. is such a name, or there's such a name, such pressure to coming up with a name. Justin. Got it. He has too much pressure. Justin. <laughs> She's able to hide under you. <laughs> Another puppy has joined the chat. Uh, yay! I want to hold that one. Why can't I hold that one? Yeah, let's let him down and go pee real quick. Yeah, I, have to go I think he already wants In the house? I'm just kidding, I don't know. Or on you? I feel like I want to give it like a day or two to see the personality, to see how that goes. I can you have dad. I can have dad. I think already have princess names. Oh yeah, you can think of princess names. Okay. 
Oh, wait. Mom, wait. can I please have her? <laughs> if Grandma doesn't want her, can I have her? I... If Grandma doesn't want her, but I'm pretty sure Grandma's going to want her. I just got so the best picture of her. Aww. Mom, she's attached to me. That's so cute. She is attached to you. I feel like they're just lover dogs sitting there. I love her eyes, Mama. Oh, her eyes nice. brown. Yeah, I think they're brown. I want to keep her. You want to keep her? <laughs> Mom, I sit down. Aww. Mom, I have a question. How big are they going to get? This week? Well, they're like 10 pounds. They're little. This one's bigger. This one's a little bit smaller. I think I'm going to dream about these dogs. You're going to dream about these dogs tonight? Yeah. Aww. Look at this one! I have a in a mouth. Ah, uh, yeah, they're sisters. Oh, that's cute. Sit. Sit. Let's name it. You're welcome. Sit. Sit. She's sleeping on my arm now. Aww. Aww. Gosh, they're so cute. How are Thank you feeling? You so much. Oh, seriously, she is so precious and so cute. Oh. <laughs> you used it. You said so cute. So cute. Aww. Yeah, I have you. a question. Can I spoil your dog? Please? Can you spoil my dog? <laughs> yes. I think I'm going to spoil my dog. You, you can too. <laughs> can a dog be overly spoiled? Probably. <laughs> I'm so excited to surprise my mom tomorrow though. Like she has no idea it's coming and I hope like that she just is so excited and it's just that thing that she's been needing, so. How do you think she's gonna take it? I don't know. Ah, I think it's gonna go good though. Is that gonna be the very next episode after this? Yes. All right, you guys, you heard it. Stay tuned to the next episode of the big, big surprise. <laughs> All right, bye. Love you guys. Bye. Did you get the dog?